Hey everyone, how's it going? So, as you can see on the table, I got some more goodies today. So, if you watched my last video, you probably know what's on the table right now. Um, so, I got two new knives and some new patches. So, I have, I got a new uh, merit patch from Prometheus Design Works. So, now I have three of these. I'm going to do a cool little pouch with these, with these patches. I just need to find a pouch that can accommodate all three of these. Um, give me kind of a big pouch, but we'll go on the hunt for one of those. I got another p patch. This one's really cool, actually. I like how simple this is. Um, oh, I really like this one for some reason. Really nice patch. And, uh, for all of you guys that probably already know Prometheus Design Works, I, I, I said it a thousand times, they make the best patches in the game. Um. Yeah, I've tried many patches, and they're, I mean, nothing really compares to the quality on those Prometheus Design Works ones. Okay, so, let's get to the knives, what everyone cares about. So, I added a smock to the collection. Spartaco smock. This thing is just bonkers, man. <laughs> I don't know why I waited so long to get one of these. This knife is, like, literally insanely good. It needs to be broken in tremendously, but... Right out of the box. I mean, it's it's really fidgety. And I really like how this little button compression lock thing they have going on. Really fun. Um, I'm going to be doing a really cool build on this. Um, we're going to be doing... So, um, I'm, I'm not completely sure, but this is what I have so far. I'm going to be doing black zirconium um, oil slick scales. Um... Black titanium hardware, um, a Zerkutai button. Um, I'm going to be adding a backspacer in here, a Zerkutai backspacer, and a Zerkutai clip. So um, that'll be coming soon. I'm going to be getting all that off of Metin Boss, or Metin Boss, however you pronounce it. Um, I'm just not sure if that's exactly the route I want to go. I, I know for sure I want the black zirconium scales. But I don't know if the, the uh, oh, and I'm also going to get a, a Zirkutai uh, lanyard plug. If I don't decide to go with the scales that have the, the lanyard plug delete. Just not sure yet, but I know for sure I'm going to do the black zirconium scales. I know that part for sure, but I don't know if with the Zirkutai it's going to be a little bit too much. Um, but I don't know. I might just go all, Zir all Zirkutai, I mean all zirconium and just uh, leave it like that, but... Uh, that's me with heavy ass knife if I do that probably like seven eight ounces, but I don't know I, I really like heavy knives. I love them This knife is actually a little bit bigger than I normally buy but um, I mean how can you say no to that? I mean look how beautiful that is that blade shape is just bonkers man That hollow grind holy smokes man. It's so good. And I was also kind of worried about these scales, because normally when you get, like, carbon fiber scales, they're like that cheap, laminate-looking crap that feels super, like, smooth. This is actually extremely grippy. Really nice carbon fiber. Um, it feels like micarta, to be honest. It literally, yeah, it literally feels like micarta, which is very surprising. I didn't know it was going to feel like that. I really like that, actually. I would like it a lot more if it didn't have these stupid speed holes in it, but, uh, yeah, well, it's just a design choice, you know. I, I don't know why they went with these speed holes. It doesn't add anything to the knife at all, you know, but it is what it is. <clears throat> okay, so let's break out the, the, the Big Mama. So, I've been wanting this knife ever since I saw it come out in, in, uh, uh, Micarta. I almost got one when it came out of my card, but then I heard they're coming out with titanium. And I was kind of on the fence about it, but when I saw that it was like honeycomb titanium, I, I had to get one. And to be honest, I'm probably going to get a Micarta one too, because I love this freaking design. This is the Luft Concepts Avant. This pouch that it comes in is super nice, man. It is padded, like super, super padded. You can put some cat eyes on it. Or some smaller morale patches. They don't have to be really small though, but really nice pouch. Super, super nice. I'm very surprised by the quality of this pouch. And here she is. Here's the knife. Oh my goodness. She's this knife is so freaking good. 
I literally just got this like 10 minutes ago and decided to do a video. I should have just done the unboxing, but I was too excited to pop it open. <laughs> so, here's what she looks like. I love this, like, honeycomb titanium. It gives it some much-needed texture. Because smooth titanium, uh, it's, you, you need some extra texture. You know, it's kind of slippy, kind of slippery. Uh, but this is just, like, it's very, very nice. Very, very textured, very, very grippy. Um... It comes with a fantastic wire pocket clip, which I don't know why all companies just don't do wire. Like it, it it's it's fantastic. It, it works for it, it'll look good on any knife. It goes in and out of your pocket, fantastic because it is rounded. Um, in my preference, wire is the way to go. Um, and Spyderco, like the Spyderco ones, this one's not wired, but the other Spyderco ones, like the uh, Capara and Spy Opera and stuff, they do it perfectly. Love Concepts also did it perfectly. This is a great pocket clip. Um, it goes in and out of a, sh a sheath very easy as well. And in and out of your jeans very easy, so it's not going to hang up. Um, the, um, the scales aren't too deep to where it's going to demolish your pockets over time. Um... I don't think anyway, but uh, I, this is first impressions. I still have to mess around with this. It has a beautiful crown spine, which I really, really like. I love the crown spine look. But it's still sharp enough to where you could probably strike a uh, magnesium rod if you really want to use it for that. But action, holy smokes, man. This is made by Riot, so you know that it's, you know, top of the line action. Quality, the quality is just bonkers on here. You have a zirconium pivot collar, zirconium backspacer. These grind lines are freaking bonkers. Um, the one thing that I'm kind of disappointed in is this choice, is this well, right here. They should have just added a little notch for sharpening, you know? I don't know, yeah. The, the plunge comes right to the end of the edge. I don't know. They could have done that better, I think, but whatever. Um, I'll be doing a full review on these uh, shortly. I have other knives to carry, but I might uh, bump these ahead of those knives because these are like, uh, I don't know, these knives are so good. <laughs> and I honestly can't tell which one I like more. Like this, this smock is, man, this thing is a fidget monster. I mean... Holy smokes, I can do this all day. All day long. And with it being on washers, like, the feel is just so nice. Yeah, I love the washers, man. If I had to pick between washers and bearings, I would go washers all day. All day washers. They just feel more, more high-end. Um, and you don't get, like, that feel from the bearings, you know, that, like, gritty, I don't know what you want to call it, not gritty, but, like, you, you know when a knife has bearings, you know, when it has washers, it's just, like, on glass. Like, Chris Reeves knives, for instance, those knives are so damn smooth, um, yeah, I mean, if they were on washers, I, yeah, yeah, I mean, if they're on bearings, I don't... Th I, well, they probably still be as popular, but the, the washers really add a level of um, quality to a knife, in my opinion. Uh, but yeah, full review coming out on these. This is just like a first first uh, impressions. Uh, my first impressions on both of these so far is a 10 out of 10. <laughs> um, no idea which one I like more. Um, I'm leaning towards the smock right now, to be honest. It's because I love button locks or compression locks or... This is like a hybrid, but... Um, that luff, though, that quality on that knife is, is absurd. It's, like, super. Everything is dialed perfectly. So, so yeah, just wanted to show you guys. Um, yeah, full review coming up soon. Um, um, the last video, uh, maybe, uh... Since, since a lot of people aren't, aren't uh, watching the whole video, uh, maybe, um, maybe, maybe watch it. It, uh, yeah, that's all I'll say. Just watch the last video, okay? There might be something in there somewhere. Okay, that's all I gotta say. Okay, bye.